tell us in the comments. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with everyone you know. Hello, good evening everybody. Uh, tonight it will be a very light-hearted uh, program with uh, all our classmates. It will, very, it will be very interactive. Our topic is uh, uh, career, no? how to increase your income generating capacity, especially in this time of uh, uh, pandemic, so to speak, in an age of layoff, retrenchments, and uh, hard to find jobs, there is still uh, a glimmer of hope and light at the end of the tunnel, so to speak. It's just uh, a matter of uh, helping ourselves using Feng Shui. You know? So part of the discussion later, do remind me, uh, this is actually an open open forum uh, session tonight. You can ask anything under the sun related to career development, you know? uh, uh, personally or in relation to your loved ones, your children, family members, or even your boyfriends or husbands. You know? or vice versa, your girlfriends or your wives. Okay, so uh, I hope you share this video live so you can invite other friends to uh, participate in this uh, uh, career and uh, not necessarily job hunting party, uh, other sales and marketing outfits. You explore Big Benta and uh, Pinoy ads for your sales and marketing efforts. For all you know, these new technologies will be your shortcut to uh, digital marketing aside from your uh, in-house no? um, digital marketing. Because normally now, uh, the scope of uh, in-house digital marketing might be myopic or uh, still short of uh, market reach. No? With uh, this kind of new uh, platforms, uh, perhaps your reach will be wider and market presence and brand equity uh, uh, reinforced at a very low cost per thousand uh, for your uh, advertising investment. Okay, so uh, let's proceed with our uh, uh, core topic for tonight. Uh, remember, for almost a month now, uh, every other week, interspersed with a few digressions uh, we've been focusing on our elements in Feng Shui. Uh, our elements are really our human energy or life energy source codes if we were a computer. No? Why is it so? Uh, this can be explained biologically and scientifically. No? Although we can relate it with uh, uh, some notions of astrology and uh, horoscope uh, uh, nuances no? uh, that we read in books uh, and that other uh, paranormal uh, or esoteric uh, knowledge. No? So, have you ever heard that uh, they say the year you were born influences your mindset or your in Feng Shui, it influences your bodily uh, human energies. No? What element obtaining in the atmosphere uh, at the time of your birth that you imbibe in uh, oxidizing or initializing your, your uh, blood cells when you were born, uh, that's the source of your luck and prosperity okay so in Feng Shui the purpose of this is to uh, seek out that energy by locating yourself properly in relation to your environment uh, your bedroom your house your office how you sit how you sleep so you get that vibes energy this these are like radio waves uh, they travel all around you but they have different frequencies, okay? So one would have a wood element frequency, the five elements that we are studying, uh, metal, fire, 
uh, uh, wet water and earth, no? the five elements. So, but you're only uh, uh, composed normally of one element, but compatible with at least two other elements. So, this defines your vibes. And where in the world, uh, in relation to our topic tonight, what career you can succeed or prosper in. In scientific terms, in the atmosphere. In the air we breathe, it will be uh, metallic in terms of uh, essence. No? Uh, in more uh, colorful language, uh, let's say Harry Potter language or uh, sorcerer language in the medieval times, that is your uh, alchemy. No? The alchemy of metal is around us. So, how does this uh, relate to navigating your luck for the year in relation to your career? Okay? So, as I mentioned, uh, normally a person has one element but is compatible with two other elements. Ka vibes niya. So, you will have actually a dynamism or capability to be in good vibes or at home with or in Tagalog, hiyang in your career in three potential fields always. So like this year, it's a metal year. If you were born, uh, whether in the USA, in the Philippines, or whether you're a foundling, as long as you determine the year that you were found, no, uh, that determines your birthday and your element. And if your element is metal, this year, Metal Ox 2021, you'll be successful because you're at home with the home base of the year, Metal. You got it? Vibes mo. Now, what are the two other potential fields that you can go into? Ika nga, in layman's terms, pwede ka mag-sideline or pwede ka rin rumaket. Okay? So, uh, Metal is produced by earth element in Chinese philosophy, Feng Shui, no? Feng Shui philosophy. So, if you're earth element, you can also be successful this year. Okay? Uh, because it's compatible with the metal element. And on the other forward side of the productive cycle of the elements, metal produces water. So if you're a water element, you can also succeed this year. Okay? Now, how to succeed? Provided, let's say, you know already your metal or your earth and your uh, uh, water. Uh, success does not fall from the sky. No? Uh, it's not like one tamad na the banana, bayabas, the guava will just fall to your mouth. Uh, in Feng Shui, the terminology there is fried chicken does not fly from the sky to your mouth. You have to work for it. Okay? You have to earn income, of course, to afford buying fried chicken. Okay? No miracle at all. Na. <laughs> You're like Rene Requestas or Tar Tansan the Mighty or Chitae in the jungle. Uh, you look up and a roasted duck will fall into your mouth or a fried chicken. That's nonsense. That's for comic stuff and uh, uh, fantasy, no? But reality bites, okay? So you really have to exert effort. And how do you exert effort in an effortless ease? Yung hiyang. Para madali yung career nyo. This is where Feng Shui comes in. Knowing your elements, you just choose careers na ka-vibes mo. Parang madali lang, effortless ease or banayad or hiyang ang pag-slide in mo sa career na yan and your energies will be in tip-top shape and you're able to achieve your human goals faster. If you work with your desk under a ceiling beam, may pressure on your head and your human aura or energy field. And that ceiling can block your success 
instead of you thinking clearly and formulating solutions to problems that you encounter along your work, the more complicated or troubled you become. No. So you don't solve your problems and in order to achieve your goal faster. There's a delay. So, so that's how uh, smooth life can be if you're able to uh, evade bad feng shui. In layman's terms, among us uh, uh, practitioners of feng shui who know this field, uh, that's a joke for us. It's also called iwas pusui, uh, avoid bad feng shui. So you will not be delayed in reaching your human goals and aspirations faster. In any field, be it uh, career, uh, love life, or uh, other uh, human aspirations. No? Uh, with in relation to your children, to your education, and generally we call your education and empl- employment gain, income generating capacity, uh, career. No? Okay, so let's focus on career. Okay, and vice versa. If you have three elements that you can engage in as a successful career. This year, in relation to metal, uh, which I mentioned, these are the earth, metal, and water elements. There are also two uh, contrary uh, elements that you should avoid. Kung merong lucky, meron ding ang lucky, yin and yang, positive and negative. So the negative career opportunities this year will be those against the element of metal. And what are these? Fire element. Because fire burns metal or melts metal. So nasusunog yung swerte ng year in the atmosphere, which is uh, metal. Sinusunog ng fire. That's why you can determine right away if a so-called feng shui practitioner or expert pretender is just pretending or a fake, he or she will prescribe wearing red or fire. But actually, if you wear red, your career gets burned. Your life luck or life energy also gets burned. The three elements good are uh, uh, metal, earth, and water. The negative elements this year, if you're a wood and fire element person uh, separately, it's going to be uh, a challenging year. No? Uh, double effort, but uh, more of an exercise of utility rather than uh, fertility. Parang yun naranasan natin ngayong glitch sa internet. Okay? So, let's go and jump first to one question posed by Lani Javier. What if a male daw, born 1980, can he engage in a career of food business? Yung mga uso ngayon na uh, home-based cooking, tapos ano, no? Uh, 1980 is year of the monkey. And his element is actually earth. Okay? But there is a special treatment and experience in Fung Sui for year of the monkey people. Bawal talaga mag-career or negosyo ang mga monkey in anything that deals with fire. And food business is basically fire business because you cook. You use the element of fire in cooking the food, in food processing. Okay? Unless you sell your food raw, pwede. So, I will not advise any monkey person to enter restaurant or food business. It will just be a failure, okay? I have a lot of uh, uh, former monkey clients who tried the chun manok, pandisal, uh, all these trays, no? Yung madali lang iset up sa kanto, uh, uh, slow capital. But for them, if you're a monkey, easy failure. In fact, I even had a client who's seen of the monkey. He owned the pizza chain, no, a popular pizza chain in Metro Manila. Uh, I advised him to close it down because uh, he was complaining. He was not even break 
King even in his operations, he just inherited the business from his wife who died. Uh, he's shouting every day, uh, taking his own experience in managing. But it turns out he complains. He's just working for his employees. Uh, the profits are just in, enough to break even or cover the overhead, uh, all the other expenses, especially salaries. No? But he doesn't even pay himself. Okay, so Lou gave. So I told him to dispose of uh, his pizza chain, and he was able to dispose of it at a, a very unfortunate time during the Thai financial crisis. He got a good bargain for it when prices were falling down by 40% to 50% discount. Uh, he, he was still able to sell it at a 300% premium to the mother franchisee and invested in all. Uh, he was an earth person. He was good for uh, real estate like our, your model, uh, Lani Javier, 1980, Earth Monkey. He was also Earth Monkey. He invested in all pre-selling uh, uh, his earnings. He invested in pre-sell condominiums, Rockwell and all other. Yung the down ka lang ng, uh, at that time, mga 1.2 million each. Now, all of these are income generating and he's just living off rent and interest. He's living uh, uh, the uh, joy of his life. Just well, short of the pandemic, before he was just traveling around the world, you know, enjoying his earnings and savings. Okay, so no, no for monkeys, never play with fire. Okay, so best business for me, birthday 1981 rooster. Okay, uh, 1981 rooster, Jenny, you are an earth rooster, so anything related to the earth. Uh, produce of the earth. So, um, it's a side niche that you can focus on now is agribusiness. No? Uh, because produce of the earth from agriculture is agribusiness. So, you do rice trading, uh, anything related to food production uh, that you can trade, be it uh, Chicken egg uh, layer trading, malakas on demand for eggs, especially now na people are quarantined, so they go for comfort cooking, yung madaling uh, uh, lutuin, so table eggs. And uh, of course, we've heard of the shortage now, no? Because of the, not only pandemic, because of the typhoons and the floods, shortage of uh, uh, pork and uh, other key uh, uh, kitchen ingredients for cooking. So if you can find a way how to deal with this uh, and trade in your in your neighborhood online, uh, which is the best uh, mode of marketing nowadays, uh, that's a good business. Water horse business, uh, Water horse business, uh, you're like Manny Pacquiao, no? Uh, Manny Pacquiao, Senator Pacquiao is a, a water horse, 1978. Now, uh, you can deal with anything related to water. So, this is uh, uh, not a public fact, but uh, I know for Weishaw, having Feng Shui, the, the group, uh, he operates an ice plant in Jensan. No? And uh, even here in Tansa, Cavite, for the export of tuna from uh, Jensan to Japan. Now, if you can enter anything along that field, no? even the lowest uh, income generating uh, neighborhood profession, which is very popular, ice for sale. Diba? Uh, you can produce your own ice from your ref or you have a freezer. Or some even invest in an ice maker uh, from uh, HMR or my second-hand uh, sources and distribute in uh, their neighborhood. It still augments your income. But if you go big time, like uh, a cold storage or an ice plant, 
the bigger prospects nowadays is storage for vaccine. You can rent it out big time. Okay, it's it's like vaccine is the new pogo. Okay, being metal dog, okay to transfer careers in uh, digital innovation. The career is all right. You're young with metal and digital innovation, but not this year because your dog Madas and dog this year. Okay. I'll give you an example of a Malas dog in the world personalities, the celebrity Donald Trump. Okay, his dog. Uh, I don't know if it's starting new year to generate more things and have good health. Ah, uh, ano tip? Tip. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, what's the tip to generate more sales and have good health? Okay. Let's address help first. I will teach you the secret in Feng Shui, uh, and let's call it the Feng Shui, Feng Shui vaccine. Okay. No harm, no foul. If you try it at home in your office, uh, just get a simple six-rod metal chain. No excuses that you cannot find one or you cannot go out. Buy one under to lay on Chapo, or go up to Baguio to buy it from the Mines View Park, uh, Changi, or Maharlika Market in Baguio. No need. Online na ngayon lahat. You can order that online. So no excuse for bad health. Okay. And you hang it in. You get at least two wind chimes if you're working. One in your office. You hang it in the north side of your room. For your workstation, if it's a cubicle, and at home in your bedroom or master's bedroom, if you're a, a matriarch or patriarch, breadwinner of the family, hang it in the north side. Okay, uh, that will give you a modicum of hiang in health. This 2021, the year of the metal box, and make sure. No excuses, mga pilosopo tayo, mga Pilipino. Wind chime, kawayan. Wind chime, si urchin, si shells. Wind chime din yan. De, in Feng Shui, is six rod metal chime. No ifs and okay. buts. Wood dog ako, pwede ba ako sa baking business? Positive, pwede pwede. No? Except that, for this year, negative. Kasi malas ang dog. Okay? That's how you weigh your element and your sign and navigate your luck okay next best career for female born on december 1981 ah for a female 1981 rooster who is an earth rooster so anything related to the earth no pwede mong karirin ang maganda kung mapasok mo yung mga unique uh, uh, careers na walang masyadong competition no madaling uh, magbenta what are these Earth, magtinda ka ng cementerio, memorial plan, earth yun. Magtinda ka ng columbario, no? Uh, okay yan. Kung gusto mong patamad-tamad, yung uh, ano ka lang, bahay, medyo patunog sosya, plantito, plantita, magtinda ka ng halamang nakapasok. Okay? So, that's the spectrum of earth. Okay? Ang... Um, Makikita mo dyan natin mga relate this year, bawal yung fire, di ba? Fire element. Uh, sa ano, sa fire, makapapansin mo, down ngayon ang mga career profession ng uh, high living na puro fire. Mga entertainment. Yung mga GRO, nagsara lahat ng nightclub from Air Force One to Pegasus to ano, no? Uh, Sarado, no? Uh, and other mga showbiz, di ba? That's fire. Ang dami, nawala sa isang broadcast network na nagsara. So, dyan makikita natin. And yung uh, hospitality business, no? Sa tourism. Mga airline crew na uh, mariretrench o naretrench na. Okay? So, ang advice natin sa mga ganitong uh, dislocate, 
I try to find the uh, jobs that are kahit na underemployed kayo temporarily, uh, tawag dyan, fictional ang uh, employment, uh, pasok kayo where you can uh, use your talents well. Ang number one na ma-advise ko sa mga ex-stewardess would be sales. Uh, yan, pasok kayo sa Toyota or other sales and marketing departments. No? Even real estate. No? Okay? So, next question. Business for Water Tiger. Business for Water Tiger. So, Water Tiger, in Feng Shui, water is also money. So, you can enter any business related to financing. So, pwede kayong, lalo na kung Mumbai kayo, di mag-5-6 kayo. No? Kaya lang kung Pilipino, huwag na. Naiyak lang kayo. No? Hindi na kayo magbabayaran. Takbuhan pa kayo. Earthen okay, so, metal, the most common industry that you can uh, work together in is construction, build and sell. So, property sa uh, house, house and lot, or you can invest in uh, foreclosed properties and rent it out, or redevelop uh, properties. No? Also, not only on the finished product, no? from the whole value chain of both industries, art and metal. So you can even deal with hardware, construction supply of materials, or even simply consulting group. Uh, you have the, if you have the expertise to be consultants, property consultants, be it property management, or uh, construction consultant, or contractors, you can enter that field together. Uh, next question. Wood Dragon ang business namin, shipping money, money agents, okay ba? Wood Dragon and? Wood Dragon ako, ang business namin, shipping money agents, okay lang ba? Oh, pwede, pwede. Money agency and uh, for Wood Dragon is okay. For one simple fact that uh, uh, remittances, money agency is also paper-based, which is wood. While you're dealing with metal currency, symbol of money, uh, mostly paper bills yan, so it's made of wood. And yung uh, remittance leave lang. So that's uh, good for you. Business for wood snake and water rabbit. Okay, wood snake and water rabbit. So two fields, again, common for wood and uh, water will be one, agribusiness related to fish farming aside from uh, literally water business uh, mineral water supply maraming forms din ng water supply no you can supply construction water you can supply cooling water for buildings for their air cons uh, you can supply uh, uh, chandler water yung baon na tubig ng mga airlines or kaya uh, barko no or mga roro uh, marami no uh, anything under the sun related to water good for you and for wood anything trading so you trade on both water and uh, construction supplies related to wood okay yeah. earth ship career medyo down ngayon ang earth ship no uh, why because uh, well earth is good Ship is bad this year. It goes against the sign of the ox. No, the problem is uh, the sign of the ox this year is metal, and metal can destroy the earth. Uh, uh, also, no? yung like yung naararo, no, or yung bakho, no. So half luck lang ang career mo ngayon, no. So lilo lang, not to be aggressive. Uh, next question. May 2000. Email. Mail? May 2000. Career advice. Ah, year 2000 female. Career advice. You are an earth dragon. So, best career advice is uh, go into a uh, property or real estate related uh, career. No? Uh, kahit na magbroker ka or salesperson mo na, 
learn the ropes. Yeah, nothing wrong. Uh, real estate industry is very good uh, despite the pandemic. Uh, partnership between metal, metal pig meal and earth pig meal. Okay, metal pig and earth, you're compatible because uh, uh, earth produces metal. Dito lang makikita natin yung uh, metal person will largely depend on the earth person. Okay, so that's something given uh, you have to accept. Normally, pag ganyan ang relationship nyo, mas malakas ang kita or nagiging mas breadwinner yung earth person over the metal. Okay, then you can go any business also ng uh, anything metal or earth related. Normally, real estate then and construction. For earth ship, for business interest. Ah, cure for earth ship. Okay, the best cure in Feng Shui is to take care of a life or water. Uh, nothing beats that. Okay? It's a cure-all. Yan ang pinaka-best uh, uh, vaccine sa lahat ng maladies ng Feng Shui. Alaga ka lang ng arwana. That's why it's such a price lucky beast in Feng Shui. No if and but. Sasabihin na, alam mo na mga pilosopo Pilipino, pwede bang statua, figurine, Okay. No, no, hindi pwede. The best is life arowana. Okay. Next. Career advice for female dragon and male ops. Okay. A female dragon, uh, ang best careers normally ng uh, dragons is anything uh, uh, trading. No? Uh, so, sa sales. Ang, ano yung dog? Uh, male ox. A uh, male ox. Okay, ox is a uh, good in marketing no? and entertainment. Then, so anything along those lines, uh, communications, mass com, very good. Might be it uh, broadcast media. Promotion for September, uh, September 1987, Lady Lawyer. Ah, Lady Lawyer, 87. Your rabbit. Uh, you're actually an Earth rabbit, no? So this year, for career promotion, you can use two lucky charms. Just use one, either or. No? You can get online a monkey riding a horse. No? That's to overcome any difficulties in your career and overcome any obstacle and become promoted. That's one. If you want a higher level of promotion, you take a monkey riding an elephant. But normally, ah, normally everything is available na online. No? Before, it was difficult to get here in the Philippines. You still have to seek off the streets of Hong Kong. Okay. Next. Best career for 1970. Ah, the year of the dog. No? Uh, well, male or female, Male will be metal dog, uh, female is wood dog. So, very, yung metal dog, anything related to uh, metal, be it computers, IT, and communications field, no? Pwede. Then, for the uh, female dog, uh, trading, no? But this year, Lie low muna sa career. Don't be too aggressive because malas ang dog. 1987, we're planning to open a clinic this year. Ah? Uh, 1987. What business? Clinic. A clinic. Okay. 87 is rabbit and you are earth rabbit. But a clinic business is uh, depends on the nature of your clinic. Okay? If uh, ordinary clinic, na medical clinic, normally medicine is related to water. It's bad for an earth person. So, papaguring ka lang. Your only remedy for that is to take in an associate partner who will manage the clinic for you, na water ang element. Okay? So, that's one. Uh, but if your clinic is, let's say, veterinary, no? related to earth-related livestock, uh, uh, pets, 
uh, you'll be good at it. Stay tuned for the next episode only here on Big Media.